Hi everybody, it's May 6th, and I need to do this now before I forget. I'm in the process of doing reading for BritLit tomorrow morning, so I can do a forum post because I need to get all the points that I possibly can. Tomorrow's review day, which I think is weird that we're going to have reading due for tomorrow, but whatever, it's a class and we're still learning, technically we still have another week of class, it's cool. Um, today was really good, I literally had only had one class a day. Push class had canceled and choir was canceled because we just had a concert this weekend. So, well, you practice was earlier in the day and that was cool. We recorded two of our songs more professionally. It's like a portable mini studio setup thing. It's basically just microphones. But we recorded Haven't Met You Yet and our version of Madness. So that's exciting. I finished Midnight Robber by Nalo Hopkinson. Yeah, Hopkinson. And I actually really like the book. It's quite a bit rapey, which was a little discomforting to read some of the time, but really adds like good dimension to the book. It's a fantastic read. I'm upset that it took me so long to read it because I'm just so awkward. I just my time management skills are terrible, but I recommend that you read that. Actually, most of the books that I've read for my sci-fi class, I recommend you read. Like Ursula Le Guin, Love, Hand of Darkness, that was an awesome book. Um, the Forever War was actually pretty good. I didn't read to finish Solaris, but I think that was good. The Stars from Destination was also a really good book. Do Android stream of Electric Sheep? I prefer the book to the movie Blade Runner, but, you know, the book wasn't really all that fantastic. I mean, it wasn't bad, but I wasn't impressed. But The Magicians by Love Grossman... I still haven't finished that book, but how far I'm into it now, I actually really like it, so I'm going to read that over the summer and definitely get into that. That'd be awesome. Random nerd up on books. I gave a tour today, which was fine. I think I'm going to be going on the tour tomorrow. I didn't sign up. I don't know if I'm going to sign up because I need to be doing as much homework possible because this is technically my finals week. All of my things for my classes are due. This week I'm not doing anything during finals week which will be exciting for me. Just packing and a lot of sitting around and you know relaxing. I'm so excited to finally get to relax like you have no idea. I stumbled upon a really attractive male today. I will not name him but it was well technically it's a dating app that you can get for like Android or Apple OS's or operating systems. OS sounds weird. But anyway, I stumbled upon this guy and he's really attractive and he goes to school here. So I sent him a message. I was like, that's cool. Because oddly enough, in the picture in one of his pictures there's a person and I have class with the person. And yeah, so I was like, hey, yeah, I saw your profile, you look friendly, maybe we should talk. I also know the person in your, one of your pictures. So yeah, small world. And that was at like midnight, that was like 12.30 I guess. That's now 2 o'clock, so. It's probably a creepy time to send a message, but I was talking to a friend about it. That's why it took me so long. Because I wanted to send a relatively good message. Like, I wanted to send a message that was, like, engaging, but not so, like, overbearing at the same time, you know? It's like, I don't really know how to make a first impression. I can only be myself, but, you know, it's still kind of just, like, walking a fine line. So that was interesting. But it's over and done with. If I don't get a response, then I don't get a response. I shouldn't worry about it too much. I'll be leaving in about two weeks anyway, so... But yeah, that's about it. I thought I was going to play volleyball with some friends tonight, but we didn't. And that's okay, because I was on FaceTime with my friend Amber for hours. As we are known to do, because we just talk forever. So I was like, hey, my friend, so I got on the phone with him, then we just like talk for hours and hours and hours about nothing. But it's, it's good. It keeps us close. But yeah, I need to go finish my bedlet reading so I can get the swarm post and then go to bed, because I am a little bit tired. Anyway. Thank you so much for watching and clicking this video. I appreciate your time and your click. And I will see you later. Bye.